Hey, good morning everyone. Hi, I'm in the Morelia Cemetery. So today is 1st of November 2022. And uh, this day, in a lot of countries, we celebrate the death day. So we usually we visit the cemeteries to visit our loved ones already passed away. And usually it's not a happy day, it's a really sad day. But here in Mexico is different. They did, um, they really transformed this uh, sad moment in a happy, uh, festive, uh, celebrated moment. And so I will show you after a few images about how these days, there are like three or four days of celebrations, how they do, why they do, uh, I will explain you the, the meaning uh, behind a lot of things, um, only with my voice and some images. But here I have to tell you that it's, it has been amazing to uh, live this Dia de Muertos in Mexico, especially in this area, because this is considered the best area with more tradi tradition in all Mexico. So I hope you are enjoying to follow me in this uh, moment, in this special moment. And please, if you have any curiosity, any doubt, something that you would like to know, please ask me. If I don't know, I will ask to my friends in Morelia. I'm meeting really, really amazing people because they are super welcoming. Thank you and wish you an amazing day. A hug from Michoacan city of Morelia in Mexico. Flowers, colors, music are the elements in the cemeteries in the Dia de Muertos in Mexico. Outside they celebrate in all the ways. In the evening, there are a Katrina's parade. Katrina's is the materialization of the death. They imagine that the death is a school, well-dressed, made up, and really beautiful and elegant. So in the evening of the 31st, there are hours of parades with Katrinas from all the universities in the state of Michoacan. And some pueblos, some small village, they come as well, showing their dresses, their makeup, their dancings. It's beautiful, really, really beautiful. It's amazing to see how proud they are from their uniforms. There are some Katrinas with butterflies because in the Michoacan state there are a lot of butterflies. They migrate from Canada exactly in this period of the year. So we will see a lot of butterflies later. And uh, they are really creative. You can see all kind of Katrinas in this parade. They dance, they have their own choreography. It's really beautiful. Creativity, 
is for me the word it's beautiful how many different dresses makeup they have look to this dress it's just amazing all the elements are there the flowers the skull, the Katrina, everything. And thousands and thousands of girls and men in this parade. It looks so beautiful. And for better Paul. During the day, we visit Capula. It's a small village, not so far from Morelia, where the Katrinas was born. So we went to see all these Katrinas, so creative with all kind of decoration. It's really beautiful as well. Here you see the clay Katrinas, original from here, but you see a live Katrinas as well. Beautiful women, girls. Beautiful mats made with wood sarast salt flowers are everywhere in the city altars where each element has their own meaning the candles the fruits the bread the water the salt all inviting their animas or souls to come back and to visit their loved ones in these evenings. We had the opportunity to see these altars in all hours of the day, evening. during the day we even had the opportunity to see how they built all these decorations the love the patient the details the smiles the passion I confess that I felt moved every day to see how much dedication everything is made from these young people. They don't earn anything. They just do it because they love and because they believe. This is the way to celebrate something that belongs to life death here is one of the letters of Morelia in this case amor which means love amor elia are being painted for this artist that was became my friend she's just amazing she paints a lot of things in the city it's beautiful so this was the way I have experienced the Dia de Muertos in Michoacan, Mexico. We visit at least eight different pueblos and we saw everything just being built and then in the evening during the day we met amazing people 
so I can only be so grateful for being here in the right time.